We're here today because I think we need to do everything we can as a community to address this problem of bullying. Uh, I'm heartbroken at what's happened in our own community here, and I'm heartbroken about the stories that I hear uh, virtually every day about how the lives of our children are in so many ways so permanently and severely impacted by bullying. You know, we throw the word bullying around loosely, but we know it's a problem. In fact, 79% of high school kids say they have witnessed a bullying incident in the past month, and 74% of middle school kids report the same. And you know, I've had a number of people recently um, in conversations ask me, is bullying really a problem? You know, isn't it what we all went through when we were younger? And I want you to know that Yes, that's true on some level, right? We can all remember incidents in our, in our youth that, uh, that were incidents of bullying. But back then, those incidents were troubling, but they disappeared into the air when they came out of somebody's mouth. Now, with technology, they never go away. And you cannot escape it. And the level of the use of technology that has, in so many ways, improved our lives has also made us more vulnerable. The system that we're employing will allow real-time reporting, safe and anonymous. And it will allow us to collect the data we need about where bullying is taking place and what to do about it. So you can see behind me in the slides, this is the kind of information um, that will be available on the app. Um, and it will, be, uh, it will be customized based on where uh, where uh, you report it, through, uh, through which entity. And we, we can explain some of that more later if you'd like. And third, we will develop, with the help of our new coordinator, the new coordinator position that I proposed in the budget before the County Council, a position we're adding to the Office of Children's Services, a full menu of training opportunities and educational resources to bring tools to teachers, coaches, recreation center staff, and others who interact with our young people on a daily basis. I've included funding in my proposed budget for all of these elements. The cornerstone here is cooperation, coordination, and education. There are many sides to bullying and many places where it occurs. We believe this is a unique program, the first in the country in many respects, and we think we can make a real difference. 